everybody at home's got to stop, <laughs> put down their breakfast, because you are going to unravel the great mystery of our time, aren't you? You are going to make sure we all now know going forward what is the single market, what is the customs union. Over to you, Kevin. Right, so I hope the Cabinet is watching, because they're supposed to be doing the negotiation. <laughs> right. 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 <laughs> Let's think of the European Union like an allotment. Okay. And right. each member country has its own plot. OK. okay. Right, now, in the customs union, gardeners from plots outside our allotment would have to pay money, a tariff, if they want to sell their carrots and collies here. Right, OK. Right, right. OK. Right. But the garden, allotments. Yeah, but okay. the gardeners within the allotment... Right. ..could trade their veg between themselves to their heart, heart's content for free or with no tariffs. OK. Right. So that's Got fine, that. Right. That makes sense. Right. And in the single market, which is very important, gardeners within the allotment can also trade their veg freely as well as their services. I'm a, okay, I'm so they you? can do their products, but also their services. Absolutely. So that's the difference absolutely. between the two. Exactly. You can do okay. you can do services. Most trade is now services, right? But all their goods, from carrots and collies to buckets and spades, have to adhere to the same standards, rules, and regulations. So there'll be a minimum and a maximum size for a spade. You can't just make your own spade, son. And there was the big frustration when their bananas were the wrong shape and, and that sort of thing. Uh, Yeah, although that was exaggerated. But there are, but but there are standards. that sort of rule that we might have picked up in the news. A absolutely. So absolutely. that's the difference. Within a customs union, you can trade freely, yep. but you don't have to adhere to the same regulations. Uh, uh, and the yep. single market, you can trade freely, but you do have to adhere. Absolutely. And also, okay. uh, you know, workers from the other allotments can come to our allotment too. And join they fancy. If you fancy getting someone to do a bit of digging for you, you they just say, pop right, over come on over, him. or you can pop over to theirs. Right, OK. Huh? Well, now we're all clear, uh, <laughs> aren't we, Ben? I think so. Is there any more, Kevin? Yeah. It also means that in the single market in the customs union, you can freely invest money in each other's allotments. OK. So that's quite good. And crucially, and crucially, and crucially, there is that issue, you can just move around. OK. So gardeners can go from plot to plot. You don't okay. have to just stay in your own plot, you can go to other plots. Clear and therein is one of the issues, isn't it, that people it is. weren't comfortable yep. with, that free movement of people. Okay. It's all got a bit Nigel Farage from Kevin. It's all a plot. <laughs> it's, all <laughs> a plot. it's always being a plot. 